but for the most part we're gonna focus on the mechanical uh, conditions so all the bones ligaments nerves and tendons muscles is going to be what we're going to discuss on this next topic which is the pathophysiology what's really going on now when it comes to back pain in this picture it explains that nerves the, the pain is from irritated nerves that come out of the back from each level of the vertebra you have nerves coming out and each of these uh, nerves are gonna be irritated which are gonna lead to the experience of back pain so that's what it means by nervous origin now muscular strain or a tendon strain this is when you pull a muscle and you could do it through different areas so overuse and overworking is one way to do it like you could be lifting too much or you could be wor working out for too long and uh, you could be sitting also for a long period of time or laying down for long periods of time that can also uh, cause pain in the muscles on the back on the low back sleeping in an uncomfortable position i'm sure i mean at least i can say i've experienced that a few times especially if you sleep in the wrong position and then for kids and children or people with not necessarily stocky constitution uh, wearing a poorly fitting backpack so you have a backpack too heavy but you're still carrying it that's gonna cause strain in the in the muscles of the back now ligament so when it comes so the difference between ligament and muscle is that muscles connect to bone so you have a bone going to a tendon and then becoming a muscle and then you move that bone according to how you move the muscle um, but when it comes to ligaments it's typically just bone to bone it's a tissue that connects bone to bone you need that in the back in the spine because basically you have a, a stock of bones so you need different types of ligaments that allow that posture to stay there but then as you get lower on the tailbone or the sacrum and then the hips you're gonna have more ligaments going around it just to provide stability in that region now it could happen that you could overstretch or you could have an injury an accident and then you tear a ligament and that typically takes a little bit longer than a muscle strain to to take care of and then the most I guess severe more serious situation in back pain is osseous origin which is bone something coming from bone now osteoporosis of the lumbar spine is a type of condition where the bones are not modeling remodeling as much as they're breaking so in a general healthy human you have a balance between cells that make bone and then cells that break bone and that's how bones model uh, that's very essential for growth and just it's just part of the process but then when it comes to an advanced age uh, that tends to shift especially in women after menopause and they there's a theory that it could be related to estrogen because in menopause one a woman has less estrogen uh, the bone that the cells that remake bone start decreasing in activity and the cells that break up bone starts increasing more activity so that imbalance is going to lead to the bones being more fragile and i'm putting a, a picture here of the spine basically being more brittle more fragile so this is age related and this is why it's very important for 
the elderly to take care of themselves and not have any abrupt falls or at least carry enough support especially going up and down the stairs <laughs>